It's recording. Okay, yeah, it's recording. Welcome back to Bruce Workshop. Today we are going to set up the models one by one. Sometime uh, the I, this is a, the, a process to help you understand uh, the modeling arrangement uh, preparation for print. Most of the people think that oh, you got some models and send to me, and then put a put a machine and you work directly. It's no problem. They're very simple. Why it so take too much time and why charging? Got extra charge by more than the machine only. But people don't understand how the works flow. Like the models of this kind of thing, if you cannot, this is a very small model, it's like three five m m. You cannot actually use the uh, to print from FDM. You can't just because it's too small. So if even in, in the SLA print, you need some support material to print it. So we need to add support to hold the structure in, and sometimes you have to create some things different. Some um, no, I can't set it here. What? By the way, but this one should be fine for this angle. So you need to arrange model one by one. There is 21 models in here, so they actually take some time to arrange every one of them. Because the first thing is they come in not separately. So I had to separate them at the first place, but that one is simple. I just use some program to separate all the one, one, model one by one. And I found that there is a lot of error in the models. It, it, for 21 model, I separate them it show up me more than uh, 50 models that's it horrible let me see another one let me see the model still here slap exam the model pre preparation you if you want to send the 3d prints and model you have to prepare them one by one so example this one look 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 at this that are so small and they're separate they are in one model stop and oh, and also that got uh separate connect surface one is separate it should have only 21 but you got 59 what where are those models actually you can't see them there are just a lot of path during the modeling you need to delete all the path before export the model otherwise it will make a lot of arrows in the model you see, see i'm select all this then that is nothing to show on the screen that needs a lot of fix on that so I have to export one by one to figure out which is which and then import to these models one by one and import that create a support for every one every one of them and then voila, that's it at least need to do this step and uh, one by one so let me finish this for this case the angle is okay three part editing should be enough but i need to add two more for better uh, better holding this one should move it back yeah it's fine Okay, I try to stick them together it, because uh, they are one group and the hardest is this model because it's too sharp the, old, the support will not work you need to have manually tuned to find the lower spot to hold the support like this and then add another support from here and from here to here no 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 Okay, give me some different different rotation to hold it well, so they should be fine like this. Okay, next will be the import models. Uh, it's the same thing if you got different models, you need to import them separately, and then the, every one of them you need to rotate it by the correct angle to print all this need to set up one by one so for this one is round bottom just move to 70 degrees 
uh, I know it's 70 degree because I already worked a few a lot of I got experience on all this because I worked all of this like this one you know you want the spot sharp spot on the bottom so you got 90 and 90 rotate them back uh, move it there this one is 90 degree this one shopping port is also 90 degree I can't work them one together in this software I had to move one by one hmm that is not good I believe in future like got orientation automatically but well before the, the application developed by someone I had to deal with it I, uh, because I'm not a software guide I uh, can model 3D models but I cannot write the programs okay let me continue all this so to double check every one of them make sure they are okay like this and the round point you need to have a support here yeah then 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 go back go back another one that is some renovation nearby now sorry about that but that's why I still very hard to make videos every day because even I try to there will have a lot of more, more renovation nearby and my cat is keep annoying him. it is he it is too too small too young just two months one month old is. oh come on okay okay let's okay the pro preparation step is until here I think it's, I think it's enough to explain how it work and uh, I will continue doing all this then it will take time and kind of boring when you look at it continuously so this is how I prepared the files for SLA print for this model is still fine because it's less less detailed than you can just add few support to finish it it when you got some high resolutions uh, uh, models you want to print them very very well they will definitely miss eat you a lot of time to find out tune out the better solution the more time spent on the computer there's the less problem you were facing otherwise you will face like uh, the, the, the support break off or the whole parts break off in the pupil break for SLA print this is annoying because when doing print at every layer 0 0.03 or 0 0.05 mm it will once it fail which mean half few maybe five six hours gone before that you can see them they, they load up from the bed that is not transparent you cannot see until it can't really come out so okay uh, let me know if you got any question about model preparation and uh, see you next video bye